To our graduates, uh, a hearty congratulations to you uh, on, on your achievements. With the uh, learning experience that you've had, that you've uh, acquired the necessary skills and knowledge to uh, improve your success in life, and with the importance of lifelong learning in our society, uh, let me encourage you to further your education at the next level. Thank you, and again, congratulations. Back at the time we started talking about a college for Henderson, Heck Lackey <coughs> was mayor, and I was in the state senate at the time. Happy Chandler uh, was governor, and Happy was a native of Henderson. County. That was a pretty good combination and we got to talking about the need for a college here at Henderson and we took a delegation to Frankfurt and <clears throat> told him of our desire to have a college here. And he came right with it. He said, by golly, we'll do it. My goodness, from that one lonely building that we had here, we now have such a marvelous campus. <laughs> Graduates, I want to tell you how proud I am of you and your accomplishments. Uh, also, congratulations to your families uh, for this honor that you will receive tonight. And I want to tell you a little bit about a journey. Um, first of all, your journey, you probably think has been very long, but it's, it's short in relation to some journeys. And my journey has lasted 50 years with the community college. It, my journey started in the fall of 1960 when I came out as one of the charter students who entered at that time the Northwest Center. There was one building, the administration building on campus. So through the years in my journey, I've seen uh, the growth in numbers of students. I've seen the growth in the physical facilities here at the college. And it's been um, uh, it, not only an opportunity, but a, a wonderful experience to be a part of the growth of this institution. And here we are 50 years later. I'm still on the journey. Uh, we're celebrating the 50th anniversary of HCC and you are a part of that too. Please don't let this be the end of your journey. Let it be the, the beginning because when you graduate tonight you will have opportunities to come back here to be a service to this college and to be a service to the community. When you do that, you are serving both because the college is a very wonderful fabric of the community and when we serve one, we serve the other. So congratulations and best wishes on the rest of your uh, My name is Cass Wilson. I'm uh, an attorney here in uh, Henderson and I attended the community college in from 1967 through uh, 1969 when I received my associate degree. HCC, the Henderson Community College, has had a profound effect on my life. I guess another way of saying that is but for the Henderson Community College, I would not be uh, the person that I am today and would not be in the position that I'm in. When I graduated from high school, the uh, I was not prepared for the large university situation. Uh, the Henderson Community College was, was just exactly what I needed. I received my associate degree from the Henderson Community College 
and then went on to the University of Kentucky. Uh, in, in my classes at the University of Kentucky, I found myself better prepared than the other students that were in the classes for me, uh, with me. And I think that is a real tribute to the Henderson Community College and the quality of education that this institution provides its students. Congratulations, HCC graduates. I'm Darrell Daigle, Director of Secondary Education for the Henderson County Schools, and I'm a 1978 graduate of Henderson Community College with an Associate of Science degree. As a 17-year-old high school graduate in 1976, HCC afforded a young man with very limited resources an opportunity to fulfill a dream of being the first in his family to graduate from college. So congratulations again to all of you for dedicating yourselves to get to this point in your lives. Your future is ahead, and it can be anything you want it to be. Just always remember that it all started on the hill. I'll always be grateful that HCC was there for me. I'm a graduate, 83 graduate at Henson Community College. Uh, graduated with an applied science degree. Uh, from there, I went on to Western Kentucky University. Um, Henson Community College was a great stepping stone for me. At, at 17 years old, graduating, I think it was just a great fit with the guidance of my parents and also uh, Bob Parks and Mr. Chapman. It was just an excellent opportunity for me. Um, my hat's off and congratulations on your 50th anniversary. And I think anyone that wants a, a good, affordable education should come to Henderson Community College. Hi, I'm Dwayne Rainier. I uh, graduated from Henderson Community College in 1988, Associate Degree Nursing Program. And Henderson Community College has been a very, very nice asset to the community that it has allowed me as a person to be able to further my education and career while being married, having a family, holding down a full-time job. I, applaud Henderson Community College for its 50 years in the community and I really truly hope to see that 50 years grow into another 50 years and the assets that it can put into our community that furthers not only us as a person but as us who will be the people relying upon those resources. So again thanks to Henderson Community College for its 50 years. graduate of Henderson Community College and a 1999 graduate of Western Kentucky University. I am the events coordinator for the City of Henderson's Depot Community Room. Um, I plan history related events and exhibits for them. And my first real taste of journalism came when I was at Henderson Community College working for The Hill. Tony Strawn and Bill Geary, they pushed us to produce a high quality publication and we might have been a two-year institution, but um, we fought like the big dogs when it came to our journalism competition. When this year's graduating class leaves Henderson Community College, I hope that they feel well prepared for um, the road ahead, whether that's going immediately into a career using their associate's degree or going on to a four-year institution um, before pursuing their career. Um, Henderson Community College has you ready for what comes next? My name is Mike Lavelle. 
I graduated from Henderson Community College in 1992 with an associate's degree in nursing. When I first enrolled at Henderson Community College, I was unemployed and didn't have a good future at all. What I received was confidence and motivation to continue my education and I received a master's degree and I'm now a nurse anesthetist. Henderson Community College will definitely give you the tools and the ability to pursue whatever dream that you desire. You can achieve whatever goals that you set forward to. Several members of my family have graduated from Henderson Community College. I think that Henderson Community College is definitely a, a treasure resource in not only this community but the surrounding communities. Good evening graduates and guests. My name is Diane Ashby. In 2002, I was sitting where you are. When I graduated high school, I had a job. I didn't think I needed to go to college. And some 20 years later, a friend asked me to help her get through one class. Five years later, I had two associate's degree through Henderson Community College and a bachelor's degree with Murray State University. While I was attending Henderson Community College, I needed a part-time job and went through the Career Services Center. They helped me get a part-time job then, and they've even helped since I graduated. I have a job here at Fifth Third Bank that I've had for almost seven years, and I'm currently a client service manager. Um, I wish you the best of luck and success in your future. Thank you for your time and the honor that you've given me to talk to you tonight. My name is Lisa Lavelle and I'm a 2006 graduate of Henderson Community College Nursing Program. I was an accountant for over 20 years and when I decided to go back to school to earn a nursing degree, Henderson Community College was just the natural um, choice for me since my husband had graduated from the nursing program. I have to say it was probably one of the best decisions I've ever made. Um, I got a very good, solid foundation at Henderson Community College. But more importantly than that, the nursing instructors taught me how to care for patients. And I use that every day in my practice at work and in the principles that I live by a lot. My name is Mitch Laval. I am an RN. I work at Trover Regional Medical Center in Madisonville, Kentucky and I graduated from Henderson Community College in 2008. Graduating from college has been the single most defining moment in my life. It completely changed not only my outlook on life and employment, but it gave me a level of self-confidence that I've never had before. I would like to say a few words about the college in so much as without its faculty, this is nothing but a collection of buildings. The faculty here is very vested in the success of its students to the point that it is palpable. Whatever you invest here, the faculty will invest with you toward your success. And I owe each and every one of you a, a very great debt. To this year's graduates, uh, in thinking of what I was going to say for this presentation, I stumbled upon a quote and I do not know whom to give it credit to. And the quote is this, the reward of a man's toil is not what he earns, but what he becomes. And I challenge each and every one of you to become the very best at whatever it is you have chosen to pursue. Do not let yourself stagnate, continually try and push yourself to a new level of practice.